We are continuing to follow a developing story out of South Minneapolis this morning. Two people were injured in an early morning house fire. Two firefighters also had to be treated. A neighbor alerted officials to the fire around 4 o'clock this morning in the 2700 block of 18th Avenue South. Firefighters say when they got there, they were met with heavy fire on the porch of the home. They found one victim on the second floor. He was not conscious when they rescued him and removed him from the home. A second man jumped from the second floor to escape the flames. One of the firefighters was treated on the scene. The other was brought to the hospital as well. We are checking into all of their conditions. We hope to update you on our news today at noon. A Mayo Clinic helicopter is grounded after a scare at the Minnesota Air Spectacular in Mankato. Investigators say on Saturday, a six-year-old boy climbed in and started it. This video was taken just moments after someone from Mayo One team noticed what had happened. The spinning blades knocked over a sunshade. The tent hit two people. Luckily, they weren't seriously hurt. The Mayo Clinic and the FAA are both investigating the incident. Governor Mark Dayton says he plans to give controversial pay raises to his cabinet tomorrow. Earlier this year, you might remember the governor increased their salaries by a total of more than $800,000, and people freaked out. A lot of criticism of it, so state lawmakers passed a bill that actually took away the governor's power to issue these kinds of raises until July 1st. The bill also allows one day, though, that is July 1st, for the governor to issue those pay hikes again. The governor tells NPR that while he will raise his commissioner's pay tomorrow, he says he does not plan to make it the maximum amount. He says he's going to base those raises on the need to attract and retain top employees.